Welcome to MTAB. In this video, we are going to talk about a CNC virtual operator training software. CNC Maxim is an easy to use software tool for virtual operator training system in CNC lathe and CNC milling machine. It is interactive, allowing the user to experience working with the two axis CNC lathe and three axis CNC milling machine with a full CNC operating panel and FANUC control panel. Installing the software on a touchscreen computer can allow the user to experience the industrial controller from a real-world perspective. In this 14-minute video, we are going to demonstrate various features of the software for operator training. When you open the CNC Maxim software for turning, an industrial CNC lathe loads up with the full industrial control panel on the right-hand side. As with the real machine, the user first turns the machine on. You can position the machine view to your preference and can zoom in and out as well. You can click on the door handle to open the door. You will notice that there are messages on the funnel control screen as you do certain activities. Using the X and Z axis buttons on the control panel, you can move the axis of the machine. For easier viewing and demonstration, we have hidden the machine body so that you can see the working components of the CNC lathe. Putting the machine in jog mode, you can move the Z and X axis. In case you missed it, there was a collision message when we moved the X axis. The software allows the user to catch common errors that can be avoided with training. Then, we press the ref reference button to reference the Z and X axis. In jog mode, you can turn on or off the spindle and see it work in clockwise and counterclockwise directions. You can control the spindle speed using the override button. As in the real world, you can turn coolant on or off using the control panel. Now let us look at the tool features. Using the tool button on the funnel control panel, the user can change the tool turret position replicating the real function on the machine. You can also add and remove tools into and from the tool library of the software as demonstrated in the tool library screen. In this demonstration, the user is adding an external turning tool. Once added into the library, the user can mount the tool in the desired turret position, thus ensuring the right tool is called in the program. Let us take a look at the MDI feature. Just as in the machine operation, the user can enter the MDI mode and execute commands. Here, the user calls the tools mounted on the virtual machine using the MDI command. The user selects the MDI button, then enters the tool number 
and then clicks the cycle start button to run in the MDI mode. You can do this for many machine functions. Example, running the spindle, running coolant, etc. From the workpiece library, you can select the shape and provide the dimensions of the workpiece you will be working on on the CNC lathe. Offset is an important procedure for the operator to execute on the machine. In the absence of an electronic tool offset, the operator should know how to take tool offsets manually. The operator can practice this procedure with the Maxim software. After rapidly moving the axis, the user can use the finer controls of the handheld manual pulse generator to move the tool for offset process. When you start seeing the chips, you're done. Here in this demonstration, we have spent a little more time on the MPG tool so that you can see how it is used. Once you see the chips, you go to the offset screen and set the tool offset. In this case, we are entering the Z tool offset.
Next, we are going to show you how to enter a CNC program directly on a machine control panel, save it, and run it using the FANUC industrial interface. As you enter the G codes on the screen, you can see the definition of the G code being entered at the bottom of the FANUC screen. Once you are done entering the program, you can save the program and the tool library created for it. Let us now get ready to run the program. Make sure that you have the right workpiece on the chuck and the right tools are loaded on the tool turret. When you hit reset and then cycle start, the program begins executing. You can see the line-by-line -line progress on the FANUC screen as well as on the simulation. From time to time, CNC operators measure the workpiece on the machine to ensure the program and the tooling is giving them the expected machined dimensions and is within expected tolerance range. The CNC Maxim software has built-in workpiece measurement capability. You can measure diameter, angles, etc. This brings us to the end of the demonstration of CNC Maxim software for lathe. Thank you for spending time with us today. You can also find the video of CNC Maxim for milling and other product videos on our YouTube channel. For more information, please contact us through our website or email us.